before we're leaving to go back to Arizona. So this is our last full day here. Um, we leave at five o'clock in the morning tomorrow. Well, that's when the plane leaves. So we'll probably have to get up 1, 1.30 and get to the airport by like 3, 3.30. And I'm debating whether I want to just stay awake because I kind of want Annabelle to stay awake for as long as she can. Oh man. I don't know. That's going to be rough. Because, okay, so we're leaving here 5 o'clock. Our first flight is around two and a half, three hours. So... We leave at 5, we'll get back at like 8.30, which will be like 6.30 Arizona time. And then our flight back to Flagstaff from Phoenix, which is only like a half an hour, 45 minute flight, leaves at 8.30, I believe, or around 8.30. It says we're going to get back at like 9.45, but there's no way it's going to be that late. Oh, well, that's okay. I'm really excited to get back, but also just, like, the process of getting from here to Arizona is a process, especially with a baby. Like, if I was by myself, whatever, I could go whenever, and I wouldn't really care, but it's all kind of depending on if she sleeps, if she cries, if she just stares at me like a kitty. Hey, cute. Say, too cute. Too cute? Too cute? Yeah. But, I'm hoping that she'll sleep. If she doesn't sleep on the second flight, I don't care. She screamed the whole time last time, but it's only a 40 minute flight. Whatever. And I feel bad for the people around me, but what can you do? Yeah. But anyway, um, we just woke up. I'm gonna change her diaper. And then we're gonna go downstairs, I'm gonna get some breakfast, she's gonna hopefully play, but she's been so attached to me lately. And I think it's because other people that she's around, every time she cries, she gets picked up. Or every time she whines, she gets picked up. So I think she's kinda gotten in the habit of, hey, if I cry, someone's gonna pick me up. And I hate to hear her cry, but also she didn't used to cry when she was playing and it might just be the environment it's different it's new things like that but I think it's also because she knows <sighs> she knows she's gonna get attention if she cries and I don't want to just leave her and a lot of times I think her whining or like cry that's not really bad and all just kind of let go She'll do that, and then it'll turn into the, oh my gosh, I'm in pain cries. And I think it's because she's sucking in air, she's, I don't know, she's putting in a lot of effort to crying, and then it's actually making her hurt. <sighs> then she's actually in pain, and it's a problem. Yeah. It will problem. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You're not a problem. You're not a problem. You have some problems sometimes. Yes? Are you cute? Too cute? Too cute? Yes. Okay, let's change that diaper. And now we are watching some cartoons. Are we watching cartoons? So, yeah, I'm playing. You're just playing. And I'm eating yogurt. 
say hello. I'm glad the kids love the tennis court because this it's is like one of my favorite places in the world. Always on the tennis court. Hanging out, watching KK and Baby J and vlogs, and they're so cute. Oh my gosh, aren't they so cute? Future boyfriend. Yeah. Is it? You think so? I love having a family. Oh. <gasps>